Welcome back, folks. In the last few episodes, we have gotten oil flowing here, and we started building our Spine of the World cargo line all the way down here from Virginia Beach up to Frisco, up to uh, Provo, and then continuing up here to Olathe, and up to Murrieta, and that is how far we have gotten so far. Uh, so that is all fine and dandy. And we have a... Uh, a line on here, the Spine Fluid Handler, uh, which has a single train on it, which is fine for now. Uh, but we are, of course, going to get more. Uh, so right now, that is the only uh, line we have on here. And we're going to leave it like that for uh, just a little bit. Because I want to build the the tracks up to Santa Rosa, up to Temecula, Green Bay, and Memphis. So that we get all the way up there. And that's what we're going to work on today. At least some of it. Uh, I think we're going to go Santa Rosa and maybe to Macula today. And if we can get that far, which we should be able to do, we should be able to do that. Uh, so let's get started. Uh, so we'll come out like that. And we will get in here. We're going to need another platform, another cargo platform up here, which is fine. And I think I might turn this road into a bridge because this is an insane railroad crossing. Uh, let's get this done. Uh, you can figure my man there are a lot of passengers there need to do something about that okay uh, hi with catenaries uh, are the others not high speed with catenaries if not we need to do something about it because we of course want them to be that they are not Okay, uh, there is a train here right now, there's another train there, but we can do it anyway. So let's bulldoze a bit. Just some tracks. Well, oh, I almost bulldozed a platform there. Alrighty. Might as well do this one over here as well. Alright, give me just a second. So that's done. It's all now high speed with catenaries, which is good, but we didn't uh, finish. Um, we need... Um, we need a platform. Cargo platform. Here. And then we need another set of tracks. Over here. Alrighty. And that'll do for now. 
So, rail, high speed, with catenaries, of course. Uh, why are you over there now? Well, we're going to have to do this so that it can get over there. And then you come in there. And that'll be fine for now. Though we do have a problem, it seems. Let's just see if it solves itself. No. Okay, train 28. You need to go in there. Uh, Santa Rosa crude oil and transfer. Okay. Uh, Santa Rosa crude. That's down here. To oil to transfer. Uh, let's just see if I'm right about that. Yeah, I am. Alright, so all I need to do is uh, reverse you, I think. And then you should be fine. No, because, okay. Fine. Uh. I will just do this real quick. Uh, Alright, now you can go. Yeah. Okay. Uh... Then we have El Paso. What's wrong with this? If that's wrong, and that's wrong, um, Pause for a second. So you need to be on... Terminal 3. You need to be on Terminal 2. And you need to be on Terminal 1. I think. Okay. But why? Okay, that's fine. Aha. Um, you need to actually cross over to the other line. No, you don't. You're down here, though. Uh, so you are going Santa Rosa, Murrieta Branch, which needs to be on. Yeah, that terminal is fine. But I want you... Yeah, this is the other one, so there's something wrong here. Uh, so, first of all, this can go away. And then this...
needs to be able to come over here and this needs to be a double slip switch all right so that's fixed then there's the murrieta temecula commuter what's your problem could not connect all station so that is murrieta So, Morietta is fine up to Santa Rosa, and then something goes terribly wrong. I think down here you need to be in terminal one. So Santa Rosa. Now, you need to be in Terminal 2, and you need to be in Terminal 1. That fixes that. Now you have a problem. Uh, because you need to... Damn it. Alright, let's just uh, turn you around then. There we go. Okay, then there's you. So there's a crude oil to transfer. Santa Rosa crew to oil to transfer and you are saying could not connect all stations okay uh, so that will be a problem here that this needs to be on terminal one two three four no you need to be in terminal three Which means you can be in Terminal 1. And you can be in Terminal 2. And then we have solved these problems. Good. And that also means that all of this was for naught. But never mind. Do -do -do. All right, so now that we have this done, then this one actually needs to be freed up. No one is using it right now. There. And this is what will connect up over here and follow all the way. I doubt that we can get it to connect up as a bridge here. I think we'll just come over and start the parallel lines over here. I think that'll work better. And where do we want our Temecula cargo station? I think we'll put it over here. So there are some houses that I'll need to make way. Actually, not mind having it in here so that Temecula can kind of grow out to the sea.
so that we could maybe make a uh, ferry route of some sort for it. I think that would work nicely. Yeah, I think we'll do that. So what we'll do is we'll come under the bridge here and then cross in that manner. And then we will continue up to Green Bay where we'll have the cargo station. Probably we'll merge it with this one. And then in Memphis, we'll have the cargo station over here. I think that's the plan. So let's let's do this. Uh, we'll let time pass slowly. Not that we need money, but just to let time pass. Okay. And then we'll come under here. And we will, this will be a little bit slow, but nothing we can do about that. Do this, and then come in and follow. Okay. And then hopefully we can pull this all the way up to here. We can. Alrighty. And we can pull it quite far, which is wonderful. And up there. Oh, and we pulled it a little bit too far. I didn't realize we were that close to Temecula. So we need to build our cargo station out here. Let's remove this. Uh, cargo. Ooh, monorails, nice. I want to have that at some point. Well, we need a cargo station with two tracks, 320 meters, high speed catenaries. And I think we'll put it. Ooh, look at that. Eesh. Can we, ooh, that's much, much nicer. Let's put it in there and we'll fix these roads up a bit. Uh, let's bulldoze this one, not that one. And let's make it, uh, no, 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 no. A bigger road. 
And we'll do like that. Kind of like that. I wish this wasn't this road wasn't bendy, but it is what it is. All right, let's get those tracks in there. Uh, tracks. Hi. Okay, let's see what it does. I'm okay with that little tunnel there, I think. Or am I? How hilly is it? It is quite hilly, actually. Yeah, I'm okay with that little... Um, but do I want to come back a little bit further? I think I want to come back a little bit further. Somewhere like there. And then come out this way, maybe take it to 230. So, like that. So, you see what I did there? I made it 231 on purpose so that I could, could get 230 on the inner one. Alright, I think. That works very well. Okay. So we are up to Temecula now. Which is wonderful. And in here, we'll make a junction. Like that. And then we need to put in some signals. And oh god, yes, I want auto signals. So we have auto signaled all the way to here. So let's auto signal there. Perfect. And then we'll just put uh, no auto signal signal in here and here, and that signals all of that. Beautiful. Then uh, down here we want auto signals. Uh, we want one here. Why didn't it auto signal? Okay, we want one here. It's not auto signal. Okay, never mind. Auto save. Auto save, but no auto signal. <clears throat> Right now we have a signal here. Okay. So let's try and auto signal. Did we? Not right there. There we have one. And then we'll put a signal there. And we'll put a signal down here. Okay. And that takes us down to Murrieta. So the rest is signaled? Oh, what? No, it's not. We did not signal these bits. Okay. Auto signal. Bang. And bang. Okay. And do we put a signal in down here? I think we do. Like that. And we say auto signal. Yes. Bang. And it signaled all the way up to here. 
So auto signal. Signal all the way back. Beautiful. And I think that's fine. Okay. So. What we can do now. Is find our. One train. Running on our fluid line. There it is. Uh, and it's going, let's see, Virginia Beach, Frisco, Provo, Halt, Upper Olathe, Murrieta Branch. Then after Murrieta Branch, we'll add Santa Rosa. And Temecula. And then back to Santa Rosa. Uh, and then Upper Olath. Uh, over here. And then Provo. Perfect. All right. So that now means that you will have more consumers Well, not really. Yeah, there's Santa Rosa is coming. And Timacula should come as well. And the same actually goes for uh, this one here. Uh, Tacoma, Virginia Beach, Frisco. Timacula should get on there as well. Except that we don't have a internal route for it. So we need to add a truck station. Uh, let's do that. I actually really would like Isn't there a large one? No, there isn't. All right, we'll 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 use this one. We'll make it 40 meters long. Well, let's make it 50 meters long. Um, we'll make the terminals low. We'll have three terminals. And they'll all be for trucks. It's town, and they will go in and out direct. And I want a we want a fence. Yeah, let's have a fence around it. I wish it was a high fence so it looks a little bit like secure. I suppose we could put a wall around. Yeah, let's put a wall around. And we'll put it in here. Like that. And then we need some truck unload stops around the place. We'll do... One here. Then we'll do one out here. One down here. Uh, one over here. And 
the one down here. Okay. I don't have any bus stops here. Alright, new trains. Well, that's because this station is basically covering everything anyway, so it's fine. Okay. Uh, so then we need a new line. Uh, we'll go from here to here to here to here to here to here and back again. Um, you know what? Let's go the other way. Go from there to there. There, to there, to there, to there, and back again, because then it's nicer. Right, and you are... What color is that? That color. You're that color. And you are going to be Temecula, Fluid, Deliveries, and we are going to need a... Uh, a depot? Oh. New depot? Nice. But it's... Buses or trams, not these things. Okay. Let's put it out here. Like that. And we will buy uh, cargo. I don't want the big boys, the Peterbilts. Ooh, new Peterbilt. 25. These have 36. These are just better. Uh, tank trucks. We'll buy four of them. We will make you. think it's this color that's the color they're gonna be and you are going on to Macula uh, fluid deliveries okay here they come all right And you know what? I think we're going to clone this train. Uh, okay. And there it is. It actually had some fuel on board. And it's... Is all that going up to Timacula? Does Timacula need that much fuel? No. Uh, let's see, to Upper Olaith, nothing to Timacula. Okay, I want to take a look at these trucks. Uh, let's speed up to what I consider normal time. Oh, that was some bump. The dude in there. All right, we're coming into town. Where's our train station? It's over there. All right. Cool, cool. 
There's the train station. That is so cool. That is so cool. Alright. Well, very, very cool. Alright, all right, let's quickly see if you actually drop anything off up here. I'm not expecting you to. But our fuel refineries could now have Timacula, yeah. So that is very, very good. And do you have Timacula? You have beautiful. So this means that we can basically supply all of these towns with fuel from those two refineries. That is very, very nice. Now I am thinking that next time we will make a... Um, a cargo train for goods and stuff like that. A boxcar line uh, that goes on this as well. So that we have the ability to deliver goods and whatever else uh, to all of these towns. Because I think that would be really, really good. And... Then I want a train line from Colombia and Hialeah over to Murrieta for passengers. We already have uh, goods. And all these sounds can also get tools now if they want them. Man, there's a lot of stuff sitting here. Uh, how many trucks do we have on this? Let's... Well, first of all, let's replace them with these man to Poland trucks. Alright. Uh, I guess there are two. Oh, that, that's the Joliet line. Let's, because that's actually going pretty far and on big roads and stuff. So we'll give that a Peterbilt. Um, or will we? No, I think we'll go with the men top Poland trucks as well. For now, I think we're going to turn that into two routes so that we have both uh, a tarpaulin excuse me I had to sneeze both a tarpaulin and a fluid uh, delivery thing because I think that makes sense alright but cool we made it this far so I think Probably next time I want to get this passenger line going over to Murrieta. Uh, because I think that would be really, really good for us. Uh, those are two very big towns. And then I'm thinking that a ferry from around Colombia here over to Manchester might kick off some of this area a bit. I think that would be kind of nice. We already have buses and stuff. Well, buses is a strong word for uh, these very, very, very old um, things. Uh, 
16, 10, 21. Okay. Let's go with uh, Hamilton. Replace. Oh, those are trucks. But we also have buses here. All right, we'll figure that out in the next one. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.